Hey, welcome. Tom Sahara here. And we're in Cairo, Egypt, July 2023. And we're just going to walk down their massive, uh, famous shopping street in downtown Cairo. Behind me is Talat Al Harbus Monument. And I'm just going to flip the camera around and we're going to go for a quick walk. Only a 10 minute video, hopefully. There, my friends, is the statue to Talat Al Harb. He was a famous industrialist and basically he founded the first national Egyptian bank and he formed many companies and factories and encouraged others to do the same. And he's such an important figure in Egypt that they've actually created a monument here, uh, Talat Al Harb monument and this is Talat Al Harb Square and just behind it about what 400 meters away is uh, Al Tahrir Square which you might have heard about in uh, about eight years ago when they had big demos and whatnot in Egypt but the architecture here look at this gorgeous bit of French bit of English Salam and yes here we go so this is one of the roads there's actually one two three four there's actually four roads running from Talat al Harb this is second there's another one there the Tahrir Square there's another one there another alley that way it's not an alley it's a road and then of course this road we're going to walk down this road to a famous uh, shawarma place shawarma is that people flock together it's rated and a lot of people review it so just uh, have a look around as we walk so this is the high-end downtown area where all the high-end goods are all the high-end shops so there's a few roads all around here that do similar things. And uh, Egyptian people are really nice and friendly, by the way. Really lovely people. Books, our Arabic books. <laughs> So you have uh, extremes of poverty here as well. You've got the rich, ultra rich, and uh, Thank you. you're welcome, my friend, you're welcome. So that was a homeless guy who wanted some food earlier and I bought him some food and uh, he saw me again and said, thank you. Uh, okay, so extremes of uh, wealth here. So you have extremely wealthy people and you have the not so wealthy but I think they have an increasing middle class, uh, a number of middle class. So uh, people, a lot of people have the ability to eat and everything uh, properly. And I think compared to some other countries I've been to, there seems to be a lot more middle class people here. And uh, which is good, which is good. And. Uh, what was it going to say? Yeah, the exchange rate. So if you've got a US dollar, then one US dollar is roughly equal to 30 Egyptian pounds. Their currency is the Egyptian pounds. If you're dealing with UK pounds, British pounds, and one British pound is equal to... Oh, taxi. One British pound is equal to uh, 40 Egyptian pounds. 
By the way, this bakery is lovely. That's where I got some food for that guy. Really lovely bakery. Lovely ice cream. Oh. Lovely ice cream. And look at the food here, guys. That's uh, 26 Egyptian pounds. That's like 60p, etc. Tons. Yeah. So. We just walk down this busy road. So this is uh, country number 47 for me. And I'm fortunate enough to have been able to visit a lovely country as Egypt. I would recommend it. Uh, one of the most iconic things that I will treasure will be my visit to the pyramids. Uh, because pyramids were made, built some 500, uh, sorry, 5,000 to 7,000 years ago. And they had their own religions and uh, their customs. Pyramids still exist. And how they built those pyramids were amazing, really, really are. Uh, I've got a video on my video list on my channel that you can check out if you're interested for uh, the pyramids. Right, this as you can see is hustle and bustle. This is rush hour traffic in downtown Cairo. Okay, by the way, we're at this restaurant, the restaurant where it's highly rated. They've got these shawarmas, they've got these like doner kebabs that are like amazing and they're just gonna get busier people are gonna start queuing up soon okay one second look at that look at the traffic right uh, that is just traffic waiting to move and we've actually walked down here this road here okay so let me show you this shawarma place This is how busy this place is. It's called Taram Al Sham. Taram Al Sham. Sorry. Let me show you a better view. Taram Al Sham. Look at the shawamas on there. You can go up and you can eat there as well. And they take your order. People queue up here, take your order, and then you can eat upstairs well thank you folks for uh, walking with me thanks for uh, watching my videos do like and subscribe and share my video and uh, I'll leave you with some road traffic of Cairo take care have a great day thank you